Hello, welcome back to Prison Architect. This is a very special uh, episode today. I'm here having a look at a prison that a, someone has sent through to me. Uh, now, I do apologize if I pronounce your name incorrectly. Uh, is it Gianni? G G Gian Gianni? I, I really do apologize if I, if I pronounce that incorrectly. Um, but yeah, this prison was sent through to me. This is like, wow. Holy crap. I have never been able to make something this wonderful. It's wow. <laughs> so what we got? We've got um, security room at the top. Um, monitoring the gate in and out. A teacher stuck at the gate. Obviously, she didn't pass uh, her studies very well to be stuck on a gate, but okay, that's fine. Um, can we close it on her? No. Oh well. I don't care. Um, <clears throat> have the dog crates inside of the power generator? <laughs> I really hope they don't chew the uh, power station. <laughs> what we have in here? We have, um, what's this? A holding cell? Or a common room? Or just beds? Something? Shower? Oh, toilets with doors on them? That's very nice, very aesthetically pleasing. Uh, same thing the whole way along? That's that's pretty cool. What are they? Are these any rooms at all? There is nothing. Oh, the cells. Right, okay. I see. It's one giant cell. Right, okay. That's pretty cool. So the entire block is a cell. Wow, okay. Uh, common room, very nice. Uh, what's this one here? Canteen? Canteen, yeah, okay. Very squishy. But I, li I like the use of the outer walls. That's um, that's very nice. No wasted space. Uh, what do we have in here? This is uh, toilets with doors, showers. Yeah, very nice prison. Very nice so far. Big giant solitary section on the top which seems to be mostly full but that's pretty cool uh, as for the cell block holy crap <laughs> that's crammed in tight I do like it I do like the uh, use of space um, I like the shower in the hallway that's um, that's very space saving as well two birds in one stone really um, more solitary in the side that's pretty cool holy shit wow yeah. it's like the sardine yard room. <laughs> wow, that's hilarious. Uh, got two classrooms here. They're pretty cool. Very nice. Again, use of the uh, outer walls. That's very, very nice. Holy shit! This guy can't even fit in his holding cell. Like he's the doors had to be stuck open just for him to fit in. Holy crap, man! Ian Hale, maybe you want to cut back on all those prison bacon. Like maybe just a suggestion. Like you can't even close the door. But anyway. Wow, that yard. That yard is so tiny. <laughs> Does the job though. I mean, no one, no one's complaining. That's um. Actually, hold on. <laughs> 122 of serious complaints, but no one in here seems to worrying about. <laughs> and there isn't a power station. <laughs> I'm just waiting for someone to like just grab a capacitor or something and just electrocute themselves. That's hilarious. Uh, that's what we got here. Uh, more, more uh, solitary on the side with more cell blocks, same as the top. Very nice. <clears throat> have the offices again using the outer wall. Very nice. Visitation along the road. Very good. Um, this is a nice visitation area here. Yeah, that's quite nice. It's a bit too um, too deep into the prison for for my personal taste, but I do like the layout. That's that's very nice. Um, infirmary and more. Yep, that's pretty cool. Some empty rooms here. That's fine. Another yard being used by hardly anyone. I wonder if I wonder if these guys know that there's a yard over here and up here and here. <laughs> oh, funny guys, funny guys. What have we got? A uh, small little cell block. This must be for the uh, the really tough criminals, the ones that like you know take candy from babies and you know jaywalk across the street. The, the real, real tough guys. Like no one but those guys are in here. The real, real antsy people. Uh, what we got here? Another, another the long cell block. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, this, this section here is for the super max. These three cells are just like. These are the people that, you know, when you're walking on the street and they like throw a cigarette in the ground and they just stamp it out with their foot and just keep walking and there's a bin right next to them. This is for this cell. This is for these these people. So if you're one of those people that do that, this cell has your name on it right here, buddy right here. Alright, moving on. 
Got more classrooms with a dog. So it's like a show and tell classroom. Bringing the dog, pat it around. Very nice. Um, got a. I'm assuming this was the laundry at one point. I think. Or it's just a really morbid room with a drain and some ironing boards. I, I don't know. Um, another canteen. Some TVs in there. Getting the TV dinner. Very nice. Wow, this kitchen. Holy shit. Wow. Do these guys know there's like this section of the canteen? Uh, like, do they. I'm sure one of them can like see through the doors and it's like, hey, there's heaps of space over here. Maybe these guys in here are just like, nah, nah, the TV's are mine. No one's watching the TV but me. Heh, <laughs> that's hilarious. We'll get up here. Another classroom. Teaching. Two more classrooms. And an armory. Very nice. And a security room and more kennels. And an empty space. Very nice. And large storage area. Very good. Alright, let's have a look in the middle of the prison. We have a gigantic... Oh, actually, no, it's probably about the same size as this one, if not a little bit, little bit bigger. Yeah, not, not gigantic, just, just slightly bigger. Uh, canteen and kitchen. Some more toilets with some doors. I really do like that design. <laughs> he has to open two doors, but that's fine. <laughs> that's hilarious. Uh, very nice design. I love the, the space saving put in place here. It's very... It's very nice. Very aesthetically pleasing. It's nice on the eyes. These guys are watching TV while the food goes cold. That's fine. Oops, I found a spoon. Naughty, naughty. What do we have in here? We have uh, another security room, some more solitary on the side. <coughs> Power station is at max capacity. Or almost, anyway. And the laundry. Wow. That is super busy. Alright. That's the... oh, there's a workshop here in, this, in a storage area. What's the one over here? Another storage area. Just slightly, sm slightly smaller. Well, very nice. Very nice prison. Um, <clears throat> very, very nice. Let's look at the uh, utilities layout. What do we have in here? Whoa. Whoa. That is a computer killer. Getting like 2 FPS here. Uh, what do we have there? We have uh, one power plant powering uh, one section of the, wow, all down here and in the workshop, is that correct, yep, one doing this kitchen, very nice, one doing just the, the wall along here, oh and this prison here actually, I just noticed, very nice, very nice, this one is doing this area, okay, I can dig it, that's very nice, that's very nice. Uh, where's the water pumping station? Here it is here. Alright, yeah, very somewhat central. Still good. Still good. I think it's like 190 blocks. The large pipes can go before they run out of juice. Or something like that. I know it's a long, long while. But holy crap, this frame rate is destroying my computer. Uh, let's jump out of that before my computer melts before me. Let's check out the regime. What's the regime like? <clears throat> I really did love the whole uh, min, normal, and max sec regime splits. It's very, it's very nice. All right, so we got min sec, a sleeping till six a.m. Nice, and we got a shower, and some eat, got some work from nine to to twelve. Bit of lock up, bit of sleep. Sleep in the Arvo. That's um, that's interesting. Oh, I suppose we're not getting sleep here. Yeah, that makes sense. Yard, work, free time, eat. Yeah, okay. Normal, same thing, but an hour earlier. And some free time in the morning. Same with Maxsec. Very nice. Um, what's the needs of the prisoners? Mainly, oh, I see. So, okay, that makes sense then to have that sleep in the afternoon. Have a nice little nana nap. So what time is it now? Where are we at? Uh, regime. I was coming on sleep time for max sec now, so they're saying goodnight to everybody. That's actually a very, um, very happy prison. What's the uh, validation like? Three million bucks. Nice. Nice. We own 90% of it? Let's buy. Let's buy some. We own 100%. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, so we can hold a safe amount of 501 with 568 current prisoners. Very nice. Very nice. 
Wow, $48,000 a day after staff wages. Wow, very, very nice. Very nice. Um, let's check out Contraband. Uh, where is it? Contraband. All time. Holy shit. That's a lot of contraband. Let's check out the last uh, 24 hours. That will do. Maybe the last 7 days. What's coming in? Just some drugs. The occasional spoon. 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 <laughs> Was that a drill? Holy shit, how do you take a drill in? <laughs> Let's have some booze. I don't own our cigarettes. Yeah, okay, so it's, it's pretty well... Pretty well maintained. Not many items are found in the uh, cell blocks. Just the occasional spoon, which seems to be um, detected anyway as they walk in. So that's um, that's very nice. Most of these owners have already left anyway, so it's not like it's a a problem. That's a very very nice tight kept prison. I'm really impressed with that. What's this green thing? What the hell is that? It's an alien! Aliens are coming! Ooh. <laughs> uh, what's the uh, policy like as well? 12 hours for destruction, 24 for escape, yeah fair enough. Attack prisoners 6 hours, 6, 6. I'd probably bump that up personally to like maybe 12 hours to all of them. Uh, thumb weapons, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah, okay, that's um... Yeah, that's pretty pretty good. I wonder how much money we lose if it's if we just put it to high. Medium. Wow, it's like seven grand's worth. Holy crap. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> Very nice prison. I'm thoroughly impressed with this. I might steal a few ideas, like the uh, whole uh, showers in the hallways and um, the solitary section on the edge of the section. I probably won't use the outer walls too much in my prison just for the fact that I'll eventually put a perimeter wall around along with a fence before it so I won't bother putting too much um, too much effort into my outer walls but I really do like this setup you've got here with the um, as a buffer as well as using it for um, for cells and everything else very nice one thing I would probably do with the gates though is put them flush with the um, with the walls. Not so much for any particular reason, just for the fact that I don't like it going into the building. <laughs> but aside from that, there's no difference from it being here or there. It's still the exact same thing. Um, but the entire prison, very nice. Very nice. Um, if you have a prison you want me to, to have a look at or review or... Just muck around with or experiment or something, feel free to uh, send it to me. The email address is gebwell.gaming at gmail.com. I'll put the email in the description. Um, but yeah, until next time, I'll see you all later.